Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Fallout New Vegas Let's Play some very hard difficulty, including hardcore. So in this episode we're gonna be doing uh the following quest which is ring a ding ding. <laughs> Alright, so turns out I don't have a lot of uh stats to see or use the cool weapons, unfortunately, because I messed up <laughs> at the very very start of these let's plays but it is what it is anyway so we gotta head out and uh, I hope these markers will navigate me to the correct place alright so what else do we have here oh Kripalski. something's up with my weapons uh, boom uh, yeah Oh, that's my other gun somewhere. I'm pretty okay on ammo. So, which way? Oh, we gotta go this way. Enter. Oh man, there's a lot of people here. Bodyguard. Bodyguard. Hey there, you wanna cruise freeside in style? You do worse than hire a king to tag along. Only a hundred caps. Why would I want to tag along? <laughs> Freeside's a rough and tumble place, but it also belongs to the kings. You have one of us with you, and everyone else will give you a wide berth. Makes the stroll a bit more leisurely. The kings. Thanks, man. That's what they all say, at first. Whatever. <laughs> Ooh, is this another shop or something? Who are you? Dixon. Looking for a fix, man? I got what you need. Oh, what are you selling? Have a look, baby. Oh, okay. He's selling only aid. Let's see if I can sell him something. Nope. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Oh. Except. Man, I have shot. nothing to sell. See ya. I need to go kill some dudes. Mick and Rolf. What you guys sell? Bonehead. How's it going? Hey, man. If you're looking for guns, talk to Mick. Otherwise, I've got a nice selection of general supplies. Take a gander. What you got here? And he's got some caps too, man. I have nothing to sell. Seriously? What do you want to know? I want to know everything. Who is the king? If you haven't heard of the king, the king. must have been living under a rock or something. The king has <laughs> his boys all over Freeside. He controls the water pump and is essentially the go-to guy for what goes around here. They are the local energy weapon dealers in Freeside. When it comes to lasers and plasma, they're the only game in town, and they keep it that way. Gloria's men are the best armed in Freeside and ruthless to boot. But her brother, Jean-Baptiste Cutting, puts them all to shame. Ooh. Their joint is the only place in Freeside to get it all under one roof. They've got gambling, booze, chems, and whores. <laughs> they're good folks, just don't cross them. They're known for tidying up loose ends with a bullet to the brain box. I need loot. <laughs> so I might even just go shoot him. <laughs> Anything else I can help you with? I don't know. No, I think that's Thanks it. Thanks for stopping in. All right, man. Where's your brother? What's up, man? We've got Mick. Welcome to Mick and Ralph's. If you need guns, I'm your man. Something for wrong with your eyes, For general supplies and other services, see my partner, Ralph. Partner. How's business? Things were better when the Omertas were buying, but we get by. Good selection from traders, and the Van Graffs keep things running. That's the thing. I have no idea. They just stopped buying guns all of a sudden. If you hear anything, let me know. Mm-hmm. Will do. Anything else I can help you with? Could you repair something for me? Sure. Let's see what you've got. 
Oh, nice. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I'll have you in mind. Do you have any special items for sale? Why? Do you work for one of the casinos? No. In that case, yes, I do. <laughs> Follow me. <laughs> like I always say, a polite society is an armed society. Hey, sweet. Ammo. Wow, 308s are expensive, although I'm no rifle no more. Which I kind of regret, I think I should have gone for rifle. Ooh, I'll take that. What else you got here? 5.56, five, I'll take it too. 5 millimeter rounds. I'll take them too. And cockroach? He took all my money. You got a 9mm? No, I don't. Ooh, he's got some some goodies over here. Naughty nightwear? <laughs> Speech plus 10, luck plus 1, old cowboy hats. Pre-war. Sexy sleepwear. <laughs> Alright, what you got for the guns? Baseball bat, C4 plastic explosive. Damn, look at the price. Embrance of Mantis. Okay. Oh my god, man. Grenade machine gun. Hunt hunting rifle, katana. Alright. Little Devil 21k, jeez. Do you have any good, like, submachine gun or something? Damn. Fine, I'll just take that. Yo, boys, are you sure you don't have anything? I really want my money back. And I'm not using 556 at the moment. I'm not using that either for now. Wait, Ed. Nothing? Damn it. What's up with you, Bonehead? Fine by me. That gone. Oh well. We can't take our money back. <laughs> we gotta go kill something. Hey, enemy in sight. <laughs> Lock and low, baby. What you got here? Man, you broke, man. Doesn't have anything. Cockroach. Any rich dogs around? <laughs> Please? I need cats. Come to Mick and Ralph's for all your shopping needs. Oh, look at that. He's got a, they got even promoters. <laughs> they know how to do business. The kings. Um, put that gun away. Hey man, what's up? Hey. King gang member. Looking like Elvis Presley. <laughs> Hi Elvis. Hey Elvis. Hello Elvis. <laughs> Howdy partner. What do we have here? Another petitioner for the king? Who's the king? Who's the king? You believe this asshole man? <laughs> In Freeside the kings rule. And the king rules the kings, got it? Uh, okay. <laughs> Anything's possible, I suppose. How much is it worth to you to meet the big man? How about for free? You know what? I like you. 
Half the people around here, they forget who runs this place. Head on through. The king is the bored looking guy by the stage. Can't fucking miss him. All right, man. Damn. Is that a robo dog? Bro, I've never seen one. This would be cool to have a Fallout 76, like a pet system and getting a robo dog. K9. <laughs> That's dope. Hey, King. Oh, by the stage. You're the King. Elvis? Look, Rexy. Someone new's come to see us. Poor boy. He hasn't been feeling well lately. I'm the King. What can I do for you? I was hoping you might have some work for me. Maybe so. Maybe so. You look like you might be able to handle yourself. Tell you what, you do me a favor, and I'll have some more work for you when it's done. Sound good? I'm listening. I'll start you off with something easy. Did you notice the bodyguards for hire near the gates when you entered Freeside? Yes, sir. It's good money if you can stay alive long enough. Freeside's not as safe as it used to be, so the money is well earned. Usually well earned, that is. Recently, my man tell me that one of those bodyguards, a fella named Oris, is making a little too much money. He's making a killing in repeat business. Once someone hires him, they never want anyone else. I want you to find out why. Specifically, I want you to hire him. Play the part of an innocent tourist and follow his lead. If nothing happens, so be it. But I'm guessing things won't go so smoothly. Call it a hunch. So, what do you say? Let's go. Okay, then. Once you part ways, return here. I'll look forward to hearing your report. Oh, and take this to cover the hiring cost. All right. Pleasure doing business, King. GI Blues. Let's go with the GI Blues. Hey. Uh. Wait. GI Blues. Let's go with the king himself. <laughs> knock, knock, anybody home? It can be bought. It can be found at Mick and Ralph's. Man, they should give that king a good caps. He's doing a good job promoting the store. One thousand patons. So we, but so far that nine millimeters going good. Uh, what the hell? I went the wrong way. I thought this is the way I came. Oh well. I didn't come through this way, did I? Kind of lost a little bit. Bro, these guys, they got everything. Need some grub? I got you covered. Cheap and filling. You won't regret it, at least until an hour or so from now. <laughs> Bro, there's a lot of vendors in this place. Cool. Hey, man. If you need to cross Freeside, no one will keep you safer than I will. How much for your services? 200 caps gets you my watchful eye for a trip to the south gate. Excuse me, 200 caps, man? I thought it was gonna be like 100, so I can keep 100. Why do I need a bodyguard? Just look around. People here are as like to stab you as say hello. That is, if I weren't at your side. I'm sure. Why didn't you give me the option to accept? I knew you'd be back. Okay, man. Done and done. I want to mention a few things up front. In order to ensure your safety, I need you to follow my instructions to the letter. We'll be heading down the main street here the whole way down. No detours. You go off sightseeing, and I go off to find another customer. I'll keep a brisk pace, so try not to fall behind. Now let's head out. Oh. Man, this guy is. A businessman, like, 
You follow my orders, or I go find myself a new customer. No real. Your left here is the old Mormon <laughs> fort. You get roughed up, the followers there will patch you right up. Not that I ever need their services. Up ahead on the next block is where the kings hang out. Don't let them scare you. If they don't outnumber you five to one, you'll be fine. Down to the right here is the fun part of town. You haven't seen Freeside till you've been to the Wrangler. What's up? Wrangler? Hey, slow down. I don't like the look of some of those men ahead. Let's take a different way around. But there's thugs, man. You gotta make some easy money. You cockroach, man. You call yourself. Alright, his job is to protect me, so. If it's me running, then we run. <laughs> or he's luring me into a trap. What the hell? He's so fast. She don't want to mess with this dude. Nothing to worry about. If you had hired one of those other hacks, you'd be up to your ass in low life right about now. <gasps> I don't have. It's just a little bit. No. My thoughts exactly. Time is money after all. Oh wait, could I or could I have still done something? Thirty medicine required. Shoot. There's definitely something wrong with this dude. Too suspicious. Even without these well, here we are. No worse for wear, are you? I trust that if you need to cross Freeside again, you'll know who to hire. Return. Report that you have learned about. Oh man, I haven't learned sh <clears throat> none. <laughs> My intelligence was too small. Damn it! But the king, he should value my time. He should definitely pay up. What's Where's up? the king? You the king? No. Where'd he go? Yo, man, you seen the king? Anybody seen Elvis? Or Elvis left the building? Dang. Hey. Stupid cockroach, man. I'm thirsty already. Hi. Hello. You guys got any purified water? Oh man. Do I have any purified water? <laughs> no, I don't. But my friend Ed does. I'll take two. Thank you, man. King, King, King. Hey. Where the hell is he? What's going, going to on? The tonight. Maybe I should go through that door? Nope. Requires. So he is upstairs. Why well, why wasn't I not able to find a cockroach? What's up? 
nothing much how about you so there we go or there must be some hey others man, there what are you up to oh Later. ladies man where the hell is the cockroach is there another floor or something no rads man I was so used at this thing man that they all have rads and the king man he's got purified water shoot I just spent my two bottles stupid king couldn't have told me yo man I got purified water alright let's sleep and probably you're gonna be downstairs ah <sighs> <laughs> Cockroach, always two bottles of water because of him. Oh, great. Now I'm hungry. What my food? Food. Ed, give me my food. Alright, I'll take four. There we go. No longer hungry. Let's take a zip of that water. Definitely no longer thirsty. Hello, lady. Good morning. <laughs> King. Hey. What's up? I still can't find him. What the hell? Let me remove the marker. Remove it. Local map. Uh. Okay, it's definitely somewhere. <sighs> what a pain. There must be a third floor then. Let's look for the next for some more ladders or something. Okay, that's not it. There we go. I knew it. Hi. Hello. Hey, what's up, King? What do you have for me? Not much. He seems legit. Oh, he did, did he? Well, that just ain't good enough. Get back out there and hire him again. Hire him a hundred times if that's what it takes. And before you ask, I'm not going to cover the cost this time. It's bad enough I'm giving the man more business. Hi. Well, you don't mess with the king. <laughs> I thought he was going to give me 200 more caps. Maybe I should have used that ability, like, even though it's 5 out of 6 intelligence. Or shall I just shoot him? What if I just shoot him? He's got a nice armor. <laughs> I'm just gonna shoot him. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Come to Mick and Ralph's for all your shopping needs. <laughs> Taking my money like that. Ta -da -da -da. But man, it sure does looks like if I shoot him, nothing good gonna happen out of it. But whatever, let's give it a shot. Whoa, whoa!
<laughs> it blew my freaking head off. I need some cover. <laughs> Good job, boys. Finish it. Hunting revolver. I'll take that. Metal armor. Sweet. Now I got metal armor too. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go report to the king. <laughs> but man, that sneak attack was pretty dope. I should have gone with the goddamn rifles or maybe I could still go with the it rifles and have my machine gun sort of back up too bad you can't respect <laughs> or you can if you can please comment down below but I'm pretty sure you can put the gun away man stop scaring people What the hell is the ladder man? Hey! The dog follows its master, so the king should be here. Hey king! What do you have for me? He dead. <laughs> ah, so it went down like that, huh? I guess it can't be helped now. Well, you're not subtle, but you get the job done. That's good enough for me. Maybe you can help me with something more important. A lot of folks around these parts who've been here a while resent the <laughs> sheer the number of people that <laughs> so have come funny. into the area since the strip was built. In turn, the newcomers, most of whom come from the NCR, have gotten ornery from being resented. Sometimes things get violent. This is one of those occasions. Recently, a few friends of mine were attacked, and I want you to find out who did it. Words come that they just woke up over at the old Mormon fort just north of here. Head on over. See if they remember anything. Okay. I'll head over there right away. Good. I like that enthusiasm. Return when you have some information we can use. Ah, man. I still we doing the still GIG? Personal space meaning anything to you guy? No. I do not know definition to personal space. <laughs> We've got stuff we're not even allowed to sell, people. Only at Nick and Ralph's. Hmm. Where the hell am I supposed to? Man, this indicator sucks. Big time. Lol. Fancy meeting you here, friend. You follow me, Wick. What you doing here? Yep. This is getting mighty embarrassing. People gonna start to talk. <laughs> How'd you get here? Just rolling along on my spurs. Looks like I just might make it to New Vegas after all. Yep. Guess it's just down to you and Fancy Pants. I wouldn't worry about him. He looks all hat and no cattle, if you ask me. <laughs> Fancy Pants. Fancy Pants? No, I ain't seen hiding a hair of him since the Tussle in Good Springs. 
I'm sure he ran back to the soft living in New Vegas, though. Look me up when you get to New Vegas. I'll buy the first round. <laughs> Sounds good, Vic. Alright, this is where we gotta go. Hey. Hello, Roy. What is it? Can't you see I want to be left alone with my friend here? Oh, that's different then. How can I help? I'll do anything to get the bastards that did this. Well, it happened at night, around 11. We'd recently made some caps off a bit of scrap we found and wanted to invest it wisely. As we were leaving the Wrangler, we must have taken a wrong turn and ended up in the squatter side of town. From out of nowhere, these big guys show up and start barking questions at us, wanted to know if we were locals. The kid there is about as proud as a local around here gets, and started yelling back at him. Then all hell broke loose. Kid got the worst of it, sad to say. They were big guys, young too. No old geezers like me. Hell, none of them looked even half my age. I was mostly face down in the dirt, begging for my life when it happened, so I only got a quick look at them. I hope you find the bastards that did this. If you want, try asking my friend Wayne over there about them. He saw more than I did. Okay, right, man. Wayne, it's okay. The king sent him. Talk. Is that true? Did the king really send you? Yep. I don't really know what else I can add. They were a bunch of guys, better dressed than most freesiders, I guess. That help? What? No, I thought you were supposed to be here to help, and here you are making accusations. Hey, mm. wait, I just remembered something. I might have heard Aww. one of the guys that attacked us call another by name. I lost a little we had just about thing. had it when one of them said, <laughs> Hey, Lou, we gotta go. At least I think he said Lou. It might have been something else. Now that I think of it, he said Lou something, something with a T. Tenant, that's what he called him. Lou Tenant. Le you mean le Lieutenant? Lieutenant. The boy means well, but he's dumb as a mutant sometimes. Oh well. I have to exit, right? Alright. Now what? Is it really gonna be sending me left and right, left and right? What the hell was that? What the hell is that? It can be bought. It can be found at Mick and Ralph's. You're gonna tell me bad job again, I'm gonna go shoot him. <laughs> no, that's gonna be too bad. Evil, evil Z. No evil Z. <laughs> hey, King. Have you found anything out? Or were you just here to chat? Bunch of soldier boys, huh? They usually don't come around these parts since their big base is on the other side of the strip. If they're coming over here now, it's gotta be for a reason. I didn't want to believe the rumors that they're looking to take over Vegas, but now, if something big is going down, I'm sure rumors of it will have spread. Ask around, particularly in the squatter areas where the NCR folk hang. You might also mosey on over to the Mormon fort and chat Julie Farkas up. The followers tend to be in the know about these things. Just don't ask her what to do about it. She'll probably ask you to hug someone or something. <laughs> Lol. And see if followers know anything. Let's do the optional thing. Hi. Well, man. I sometimes really hate the way this thing works. I guess still need to go that way. It can be bought. It can be found at Mick and Ralph's. What are you doing? Nothing, kid.
So there and here. Damn it, I think I went the wrong way. Hello. Hello. Don't think I've seen your face before. Are you a citizen of the NCR? No. Nope. You don't look like you're from around here, so I guess I can believe that. Just head to the northwest part of town by the old train station. We start handing out supplies at six every night. There'll be some guards by the door, but just remember that the password is hope, and they'll let you by right quick. Hope. I'll give you five caps for the roaming. <laughs> you heard that? Hey, Ed, where are you? What the hell? The marker sent me this way, but there's nothing here. Great. Oh, look at that guy. Yo, yo, this way. Come here. Why do I feel, have a feeling I'm falling right into the trap? Uh, hello. Thug. Another thug. And another thug. <laughs> Let's talk business. What's up, man? Check it out. Between the dumpsters there. Who is that? The last person stupid enough to follow me down this alley. Get this fool, boys. Hey. You Loot. Fine, I'll take that. Man, you ain't got none. Man, these thugs are broke as hell. Oh, that's empty. I'll take the bot. Alright, I guess we're gonna have to break this episode down into two parts. So, Z Clan and everybody else, I hope you enjoyed the current episode. And if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity. As those comments get triggered by YouTube, nobody see them, nobody can read them, nobody can respond to them. So if you want your comments to be read, feel free to comment. The only thing that I ask of you is do not swear. If you're new and you subscribe, well, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Sol from Ukraine, so I'm from Ukraine. Once again, thanks all for watching this episode. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs> this is actually pretty fun. <laughs>